Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Michael here, Shot City Yacker, with an advanced tutorial for you to try out on your kayak if you are ready for it. It's a presentation that's widely known through the Charter Captain community. It's been around for years now, and, and you might have seen it uh, referred to in an abbreviated fa uh, fashion on some of the forums or Facebook groups. You know, you'll see people say hottest setup was the SWR and X XYZ, and they're talking about the SWR, and that's what we're gonna focus on today. Now, the SWR stands for Secret Weapon Rig. Now, it sounds all mysterious, and oh, I wonder what that is. It must be kind of cool, it, it, it kind of is. And let me share with you what it is and how it's ran on a boat, because we're gonna do a modified version of this out of the kayak. So maybe we can call it the MSWR, I don't know. Anyway, the SWR consists of a downrigger, leg core rod, and then your presentation of choice on the end of it. And what they'll end up doing on the boat is they'll let out however many colors of lead core, one color, two color, or however many, and then they know that however many colors they have, let's say, for example, two colors, which gets you about 10 feet down, and they'll shoot the downrigger down, say, 60 feet. Now, you have to factor in that the lead core has 10 feet of drop because it's two colors out, plus, the downrigger which is 60 feet so in actuality you're working 70 feet of water that presentation is roughly around 70 feet of water now you might be wondering well why would i want to do this why wouldn't you just put on the downrigger put it at 70 and call it a day why get the lead core involved well that's where the secret part of this whole thing comes into play now if you're familiar with lead core maybe you do know maybe you don't know but lead core because of the, the way it is when it's in the water it kind of undulates. It's got a very distinct motion to it. And a lot of times people credit that motion to getting the fish to bite when other setups won't work. Lead core does that. The longer the, 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 the amount of lead core you have out, the more colors you have out, that more of that effect. When you make your turns, uh, the current is moving it around. It has this very undulating effect. And so when you, you take that into account and you put that presentation down on the downrigger, not only are you getting your baits deep where you want it to be, but you're also taking advantage of that lead core that's moving around very fluidly in the water. Uh, it, it's almost like a hypnotic kind of uh, thing for these fish that can really get them to bite. And so that is what the secret weapon rig is. So how can you do this out of your kayak with the modified uh, secret weapon rig? Well, it's pretty simple here. Now, if you have a downrigger on your kayak, you can basically just do what I said the way the boats do it. If not, if you're like me, uh, you're gonna use torpedo divers. I love them. I highly recommend them over downriggers. It's a personal preference of mine. We might talk about that in a more detailed video uh, soon. But, and you have to excuse me, flies are everywhere. It's crazy out here. Uh, what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna demonstrate this. I've got a lead core rod right here. And I'm gonna let out, just for example here, one color of lead core. All right, we're gonna set this out. Now we know that lead core again, roughly about five foot per color. So that means we're gonna have about five foot uh, depth out of this one color. Now I'm gonna let this color all the way out. All right, I'm gonna stop it. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my torpedo diver. I'm just gonna grab one here, it doesn't matter. Uh, I would recommend the heavier ones, the biggest ones. Right now they're on my other rods, so I'm just gonna use one for demonstration purposes. You're gonna take it, you're gonna hook it onto your line. Now what I could do is I can let my line down five feet, 10 feet or whatever. In this case, I'm just gonna do five feet for demonstration purposes. Done. Now I have my torpedo down five plus that one color means I'm actually working 10 feet of water right now. And I'm taking advantage of that lead core which is undulating in the water. And this is a way to get fish to bite when they might not be biting your other setups. Check this all out, see how it works out for you. It can be done from the kayak. It's gonna make sure you know your, your depth chart on your torpedoes. If you go to a torpedoes website, they have the depth charts for each size of their uh, torpedo divers. So you can follow that chart. It gives you a rough estimate. It takes into account your speed. Uh, and then you can implement this to get you on some fish. 
Let me know how that works for you guys. Any questions, leave it in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more tutorials, tips, and how to fish Lake Michigan kayak fishing for salmon and trout, and check out the outings we have, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video, and consider supporting me by checking out the channel memberships and the Patreon down in the links below, as well as my Amazon store where you can get all the gear that I have at absolutely no additional cost to you, and it does support me. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.